Fukshin Liao Ning China August 20, 2024. <laughs> Tornadoes have entered a high incidence period again. According to CCTV News, at around 2 p.m. on August 20, a tornado occurred in Fuxin City, Liaoning Province, damaging houses in nearby villages. According to preliminary statistics, more than 20 households were affected and more than 100 people were affected. <laughs> Many local high-speed trains were stopped due to tornadoes. In this regard, Chai Kuiji, a senior engineer at the Northeast Cold Eddy Research Key Open Laboratory, said both the Northeast Plain and the North China Plain have relatively flat terrain and are in the temperate zone. Cold and warm air often meet here, and strong convective weather is prone to occur. Every year in the north is there are about three to four tornadoes, with an average of one to two in Liaoning per year, often appearing from June to August. Chai Kuizi said that these relatively serious tornadoes have one thing in common. They'll occur against the backdrop of a cold vortex. In addition to the relatively unfavorable low humidity and high condensation height, the environmental conditions under the backdrop of a cold vortex usually have other favorable conditions. In fact, experts encounter some difficulties in judging the level of the tornado because the intensity of the tornado changed as it moved and its path passed through dense high-rise buildings and industrial areas in villages, urban areas and industrial parks. With a total length of about 14 kilometers, it was very important and difficult to determine when the tornado was at its strongest. In the end, Experts conducted on one site investigation along the tornado's path and found that the second floor of a reinforced concrete frame structure had been raised to the ground in the middle of the industrial park. They determined that the tornado reached its strongest point here and determined that its intensity was China's tornado intensity level 4, equivalent to EF4 level. Current research find that the number of tornadoes in Liaoning has a good positive correlation with the number of cold vortex days, and the stronger the intensity of the cold vortex, the farther the distance between the center of the cold vortex and the tornado, there are differences in the thermal and dynamic environmental parameters of the Liaoning tornado and the tropical cyclone tornado under the background of the cold vortex.